So we're going to discuss kidneys, bladder, and water. I know it might seem a bit of a strange topic to talk about. Let me give you some facts. Your bowels need two liters of water a day just to function properly. By the time you're thirsty, you're probably already dehydrated. You may have read or heard of the classic book, Your Body's Many Cries for Water. Dr. Batman Gilgey, or he's sometimes called Dr. Batman or Dr. B for short, was a political prisoner in Iran. At gunpoint, he was told to cure a man's stomach ulcer. At no point did he have access to medication, so he used the only tool he had, which was water. His classic book outlines how he made a huge impact for virtually every disease on the planet just by administering this life-giving substance. In later sex, sex sessions, we'll discuss things we can do to add to your water to make it more alkaline, which will raise the pH and superhydrate the cells of your body. For now, we're going to begin to discuss some of the brands of water I recommend. And as most of them retail for about $3.50 each for five liters, it's about as in, in, inexpensive as a soft drink a day to stay healthy. Consider it an investment in anti-aging. Your kidneys are the second most important elimination organ in the body after your bowels. They filter the blood, they're involved in keeping electrolyte balance, acid and alkaline balance, and play a major role in maintaining blood pressure. Impaired kidney function can impair cardiac function, and kidneys also play a role in hormones. When the kidneys aren't working optimally, people can experience fluid retention, that is reabsorbing their own urine, including toxins, acid, urea, and creatinine, often experiences puffy wrists, puffy ankles, or puffiness under the eyes. If you have puffy wrists or ankles, or to a lesser extent, aches and pains anywhere in your body, you have urine there, or more specifically, substances that should have been eliminated in your urine. It's useful to think of water as being fuel for the kidneys. Drinking water is possibly the cheapest medicinal product you have at your disposal. About 70% of your planet's surface is water, and your body is similarly around 70% water. Water is so essential for human life that traditionally, human civilization has not been able to flourish unless around major waterways, such as the classic example of the Egyptians on the Nile. One of the most famous studies of water was done by uh, Dr. Man, Dr. Batman Gilly when he was in prison where he studied over 3,000 prisoners. And some of his favorite sayings include, you are not sick, you are thirsty. Don't treat thirst with medication. And you're not just what you eat, you're what you drink too. He states, your muscles that move your body are 75% water. Your blood that transports nutrients is 82% water. Your lungs that provide you oxygen are 90% water. Your brain that is the control center of your body is 76% water. Even your bones are 25% water. The United, Nation, the United States National Research Council suggests women take 2.7 liters of water daily and men 3.7 liters. They simply describe these levels as adequate. Unfortunately, much of our tap water contains herbicides, pesticides, pharmaceutical products, chlorine, lead, fluoride, heavy metals, antibiotics, industrial pollutants, and radioactive materials. The list of common contaminants could run into the thousands. So there's three major forms of ways to filter water. The first thing you can take is distilled water. Think of this as being pure water. You only put distilled water into your iron or otherwise it will corrode. Maybe it's time you give the same gift to your body. Secondly is reverse osmosis. The process of reverse osmosis achieves a purity close to distillation. It involves water that is separated with a thin sheet of material called a membrane. Due to pressure, pure water tends to pass from one side of the membrane to the other, leaving the contaminants behind. The three most suitable brands of water in Australian supermarkets, I believe, in terms of purity, is number one, Aqua Pura. Now this has a clear bottle with an aqua lid and aqua label. The second is Refresh Pure Water, which is a square bottle with curved edges with a yellow and blue label. And thirdly is Noble's Puree Pure Water, which is comes in a cask, like a wine cask, inside a cardboard box that has aqua at the top and white exterior for the bottom three quarters of the packet.